Hello, seventh graders. If you're clicking on this link, it means that you need to do an assignment because for some reason you can't play. This is a clapping assignment in Sight Reading Factory, and I'm going to show you how to do it in this video. You go in here to the, the date of your assignment. You click on Option for those who can't play, Clapping to Sight Reading Factory, and you click on it. Here are the directions in case you need to read them, and then this is the video of how to use it that you're watching right now. And here is how we get in there. You all now have an account to Sight Reading Factory. You would use your school email. I'm just going to type in my Gmail account because I need to be different than you. And then your password is RMS7BAN. Now your, your smart music password is RMS6BAN. Um, I'm, that's because we never changed them. Um, so for this, it's going to be RMS 7 band. And then you log in. Now you won't see all these different classes here, but I'm going to, you, you might have a screen that looks something like this. I don't know. You always have to check up here to see what, what you're, what you're going to be doing. Um, so I'm going to click on assignments. That's that's what we're going to be looking at right now. And you go to your assignment that says Students Without Instruments. Then you click Launch. And then you test your microphone. And in a couple seconds, you make some noise. Da 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 and then you click on listen. Noise. Da, 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 they force da, da, you to check da, 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 to see if it's working. Da, 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 da. And then you click on sounds good. All right, so you're going to be doing a rhythm assignment. So you click on rhythm only. And you click start. Now, these rhythms are going to be a little tricky. Um, that's because we've been playing songs now that have 16th notes. Here's a hopper grass. And here's a grass hopper. And here's an eighth note rest. Now you watch the red line and you try to copy with it exactly the same. Here's an example. I'll try it here. It's pretty slow. Hopper, grass, ta, ta, ta. Grass, hopper, ta, ta, ta. Grass, hopper, ta, ta, no. One. And three, four. One and and three and four. Copper grass, ta, 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 ta. So now, it's not terribly easy to do. Um, I'm made this assignment a little bit trickier because I want you to spend some time on it. Um, so if you wanted to hear a recording of how it's supposed to sound, you click on recording. And you can only hear this recording. Whoops. Um, I don't want to submit my assignment. I want to click on play. All right, you can, right here. You're only going to be able to hear the assignment slow. after you're done Hopper trying. Grass. Ha, ha, ha. Now, right there, you can see I'm not quite exactly with the red line. Grass, upper, ha, ha, no. One. And three, four. One and and three and four. So grass, as you can uh, see right there, I wasn't totally with that red line. So I'm going to want to try another one. Okay. Um, if you click on the sync button, it will just play it for you. That I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really do that one. Um, synth and recording is me plus the piano at the same time seeing once if I sound exactly like it. They're going to play it. Try it here. And I'm going to sing. pretty slow. Hopper, grass, ta, ta, ta. And see, now I can hear if I'm exactly the same. One, and three, four. Okay, these are all new features that they've added to, to Sight Reading Factory this year. So that 
that gives you kind of an idea if you got pretty close or not. So if you don't sound like the piano, then obviously you want to keep submitting or keep trying it until you get good at it and then submit it. And then of course here's the submit button. So that is your assignment for students that don't have an instrument. I expect that you would give it some tries. Please know that when you submit an assignment, I see the number of attempts that you make. So if I'm going to see that you just did it two times or whatever, it's going to tell me that you really didn't put a lot of time into it. You need to be spending 15 minutes on this assignment so that you get good at it. So please make sure you do that and good luck.